Hi everyone, it's Caroline. Today's Junk Journal July number 26 is Cozy. And I took one of my October uh, decorating magazines because the first thing I thought of, well, the first thing I thought of was my, my fall mushroom here. And I have printed this off. I'm going to use this with the pretty fall leaves. Very cozy. The other thing I have is a tea bag that we drink a lot of tea when to get cozy. <laughs> so I'm going to use that perhaps. I also harvested from my decorating magazine, the, the uh, October one, an old one. I have a fireplace. It is a gas fireplace, but that's okay. That, that gives cozy. And also I have some blankets here that are cozy and I have a couple of scraps. One from my graffiti roll and one from a recently stained um, receipt. So we'll see how I can use all this on, this is the page that we're using today and I just covered up the previous one. We'll use my tea bag first, just to give some texture. These colors are certainly not cozy colors, not in my, not the way I see cozy. Anyway, I'm gonna use I'm going to use this one because it has less um, less staining on it. Put that right in the middle. No particular reason. Just going to set it down like that. The fireplace. Not too sure about that either right now. I still have some tea leaves here that are stuck to the bag. Maybe I don't need the whole stem. I can probably cut some of that off. doesn't have to be that tall over here let's let's do some placement here this graffiti roll maybe that can go in here somewhere the other thing I want to do is have some journaling space so this may be because it's blank on the back I may use this as my journaling spot so maybe I will continue to use use this I could put this over here kind of the same colors kind of blanket put the fire here I'm not even gonna see my tea bag that was a bit of a waste wasn't it okay so I'll glue this down you know what I'm, I'm going to rip this off I'm going to be bold, my bold move, and rip that off so that I can use that after. I'm going to put this down. I think I want that up there. I think that's what I do. I think that's what I said. Okay, I like that. A little bit of the fire peeking out. doesn't have to be the whole thing. Yeah, I think that's... And then I can put this over top somewhere over here actually what I can do here too is I can I can just sort of curve around to use the whole corner of this page here. And I like the gingham tartan. That's a cozy feature for for scarves and blankets, flannel shirts, that kind of thing. I used to have a flannel shirt. I don't have one anymore. And speaking of cozy and just what that evokes for me, fall, fall and beyond. But it also, just listening to the birds right now at my window, it, the birds are changing. The sounds of the birds are changing. 
I've also seen a, an influx of hummingbirds, so I don't know if this is part of their migration path. And I know I've seen some migratory posts um, of certain certain species of birds. I'm going to use this this one here. I'm not going to use the whole thing. I'm just going to break it up a little bit. Just want a little strip here, just to put blend in this this part. Like that. Do a little scrunch. Like that. Collage. Do whatever you like. <laughs> whatever feels right. Oh, I will. I will put I'll put the bag, the t part of the tea bag that has a lot of the a lot of the staining on it, and I think that'll just pull it together. Right there, and I like that, the way that blends in. This has been so great, and I got this at the thrift store for $2 or something. And it had a hard cover, and I don't know what I did with that. It must be somewhere waiting to be used. And I'll use the rest of my tea bag. And then I'll use this to journal on, and I'll clip it. That's what I'll do. And I have peppermint growing in my garden. I have two kinds. I have regular, and I have chocolate, chocolate mint. Oh my gosh, if you don't have any and you love tea, I just pick the leaves, I come in and I just let them steep. And it is, it's like drinking it after eight. I recommend it. <laughs> Go out and get some, you'll, you'll have fun. And you can make, a, oh, that would make a great iced tea also. If you like iced tea. Yeah, I've been harvesting that all summer. And you could pick the leaves and dry them too. But I have enough tea. Okay, there's my little collage. Actually, you know what I'll do? Oh, I'll put I'll put some of my my leaves on here. Right here. Going to rip this probably right about there. And that is your, that's my little space, my collage space. I'm going to give myself some rounded corners. That, and I have both sides if I want. I'll I'll just break for a moment and I'll call I'll uh, journal and I'll come back. I just wanted to I today is cozy so I am using these letters down here C L that's what I think they are which is my initials which is hilarious. I'm going to say C O. There we go. Here's my little journaling card that I have attached with a paper clip. And I just did a little collage, nothing fancy. A little bit more on the back. I just added this little tab that was scraps from another project. So that will go on. And then my page 
is again a collage. I have fire. This is everything that makes me feel cozy. Fire, fireplace, blankets. I also put this fall tree here from a European stamp. And then this was my graffiti roll that I did. And this is our um, shaggy, shaggy mushroom that, that grew in our yard. And I took a picture of it and there it is. This is all very cozy. And I'll just put this on here. And I hope everybody has a cozy day. A refreshing day, wherever you are in the world. I know it's different climates right now. And have a very adventurous and fresh day today. I'll see you very soon. Bye, everyone.